12 moments where BTS's Jin was unintentionally the funniest person alive. The heartthrob of BTS ARMY, Kim Seok Jin, requires no introduction. He has made his throne in the hearts of people with his singing and songwriting. He also released three solo tracks, but that is not all he is. Apart from being a handsome singer, Jin's humor is top-notch. He cracks up his bandmates and the ARMY by just being himself. For the ARMY, the only comedian that really matters is Jin. Let's look at the best moments when Jin was unintentionally the funniest person alive. This video is going to be a treat for every Jin lover. Every day in In The Scoop, Jin would wake up and repeat a routine that made everybody laugh. He knows how to start his day just right. Immediately after leaving the tent, he would walk up to the punching bag and hit it. He has hit the punching bag with a bat and even a yoga mat. Mostly, he would just give the bag one hit. Just one. It became a routine in season one. He would start off his day with a punching bag and then walk off to get a juice and get on with his day. It's hilarious watching him do this day after day with no explanation as to what this is about and why just one hit. What do you do when you want to be the first one to wish someone their birthday? You stay up and wait for the clock to strike 12. But this does not work for Jin. He has to be really the first one. So he makes his own rules, and that means he wishes birthdays months in advance. When it was Suga's 28th birthday, Jin was not ready to take any risks, so he wished Suga more than three months in advance. On December 31st, 2020, he tweeted, Yunki, happy birthday. There is no one faster than me when the actual birthday was on March 9th, 2021. Only Jin can do something like that and crack people up. In another one of his moments, Jin tweeted an art piece. Later, it was revealed that he stole it from a fan and just tweeted it without bothering to give any credit. It is something only Jin can not only pull off, but also somehow make seem hilarious. His humor knows no bounds, and the army is thrilled by every maneuver he pulls. It seems like Jin lives in the future. During COVID, when BTS held live concerts, he gave the ARMY the funniest advice to make their concert experience 4D without any great technology. He said in one of the behind the scenes that sprinkle some water with a cap on yourself when you see me sprinkling water, and that would do the trick. No extra effort needed to feel a part of the concert physically. During a fun comeback countdown session after the release of BE, Jungkook asked Jin if he still thinks that he is incredibly handsome. Jin's reply to this question was effortlessly hilarious. He claimed that the mirror is the only thing more handsome than him when he goes out. He also said that like Dracula, he absorbs other lives which are cold and freezes his face so the aging is prevented. How witty is that? In the 13th episode of The Law of Jungle, Jin failed to catch any squid one night. So the next morning, he coiled a wire around the BTS Army light sticks, also known as army bombs, to invent a new fishing rod. He seemed very satisfied with this new use of the bombs. He sat waiting for a fish for a long time. And eventually, when he was ready to give up, he reeled the line back and a fish came with it. He was thrilled and claimed that he's got a connection with fish. In some situations, the reactions given by Jin are funny. He does not even try to be funny, he just is. Jin was trying to carry a bunch of stuff in his arms once. The things kept falling down one after the other from his arms, and his reactions were hilariously cute. He kept asking the people to pick up the stuff and put it back in place before the boys caught up with him. Watching him like this melted many hearts. Jin had a pink flip-flop cell phone. The cute phone raised the curiosity of the fans. Jin has proudly flaunted his flip-flop phone on many occasions. His way of doing this is so adorable that it puts a smile on the faces of the people watching him. That's how he makes everyone smile with his little quirks without even trying at all. In the Late Late Show with James Corden, a game of hide-and-seek was played. The person who will find four out of seven hidden BTS members was to be the winner. Jin saw this as an opportunity and hid in the photo booth where he kept taking his pictures until discovered by the actor Ashton Kutcher. He hoisted Jun up on his shoulders and carried him to the stage. Jun was so embarrassed that he covered his face with the photos from the photo booth. It was one of the most hilarious moments of Jin on the television. When the boys dropped the season four of Bon Voyage series, they were almost ready to go, but not without checking themselves out one last time. 
as J-Hope was setting his hair in the front camera of his phone. Jin was thinking they will take a selfie, stayed in a pose, and waited for J-Hope to be done with his hair. When J-Hope was done, he kept his phone down until Jin told him that he wanted a selfie and he'd been posing the whole time. It was chaotic and crazy and made people laugh a bunch. Jin says what he feels like when he feels it. On one show, he noticed that the painting made by Taehyung has its paint dripping. He immediately passed a comment that, quote, your artwork is crying. The way he said it, everybody cracked up, including Taehyung himself, and the whole scene turned into a chaos of laughter. In 2017 for Jun's birthday, Jimin surprised him with a neon yellow cake and a fuzzy jacket. Since the cake looked all Play-Doh-ish, Jin asked Jimin if it was edible. Jimin was playing. He told him to try and tell. Instead of taking a piece, Jin went face first into the cake and took a bite, which he immediately spat out and told Jimin that it was good, like well-refined sugar. <laughs> Nothing can phase him. He turns everything into humor without knowing it. All right, guys, this is it for today. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Press the bell icon so you never miss any video. If you have any suggestions for the next videos, leave them in the comment box. See you guys in the next video. Until then, take care.